Hello everyone. My name is Joy and this is my very first YouTube video. Um, I plan on it not being my last. I hope everyone likes it. Uh, please leave comments below. Um, I was just wanting to talk to you really quick about uh, Traveler's Notebooks. I have a quite a large collection. This is a rabbit hole that I went <laughs> I went down into in about 2013 and I'm still there. Um, I love them. I've bought and traded and sold and um, it's kind of like a hobby for me and I absolutely love it. There are some of the notebooks that I will have for the rest of my life that I will hand down to members of my family. Um, and then again, like I said, I've, I trade, I've, I sell. Um, so the buy, sell, and trade groups are excellent. Um, this actually right here, this is my Foxy Fix collection. Um, I may be missing one or two. I'm not exactly positive, but I hope at some point to be able to share with you my entire collection. I have several different makers. I have, of course, Chic Sparrow, Zencraft. I have Speckled Fawns. I have Annika Hamby, Jonelli Fish. Um, I have Peppermint Doxy. I have one by three speckled fawns. I have, I can't think of anybody else, but <laughs> I'm sure if they've made one, I've had one. <laughs> um, the reason that I wanted to come today though is to talk to you about this notebook specifically. I ordered this about a month ago. It came last night. I wanted to do an unboxing video as my first video. However, I couldn't wait to open it. So, this is my Boss Babe in the color Kate, which is navy blue. It has black stitching because that's the closest thing to match. They didn't have navy blue. Um, actually, I've um, customer service has contacted me. Excellent customer service. I give them a, a definite thumbs up. Uh, on customer service. Um, the leather is a little different than I had expected. They kept talking about how smooth it is. It is smooth, not like the Butterscotch Wonderlust smooth. And I know that some of those are actually pebbly, but I figured, I assumed that this was going to be a thick, substantial, smooth leather. Well, it's not real thin, but it's not as thick as I thought it was going to be and it's definitely floppier than I thought it was going to be don't get me wrong I like floppy I just thought I was purchasing a thick substantial you're going to have to break it in type of notebook um, so it wasn't quite the leather I was expecting beautiful all the same I'm telling you I'm a leather person love leather I'll tell you about some of the details that I got on this um, I got the, the spine automatically comes with the Boss Bay. Um, I ordered the larger spine. I think it was 1.5. The one goes from, to four notebooks, it'll, it'll cover, hold the four notebooks. This one says it will hold six. So I've actually got six in there. I think it'll hold more. The pen loop has the new elastic on it. I've never had a problem with any of my pen loops, so I just find a pen that fits. I love pens too, so maybe if you don't love pens, you need to look into a different size occasionally. <laughs> um, but it's a beautiful color. Um, just a few minor disappointments. I, I think everything will be fine. Um, you know, sometimes they just kind of have to grow on you. This is the first time I've ever felt of this leather. It's not like, you know, I had a Rowena and I was ordering another one and knew exactly what I was gonna get. Um, but it's, it's very nice. So I believe I'll keep her. <laughs> the, um, I've got the embossed initials on the back. It's JBB. This was probably my biggest disappointment and this I'm sure was my fault. I thought this was gonna come in the circle, which I think is gorgeous. Um, when I go back and look, it's not even an option, which is kind of odd. So 
Uh, again, probably my fault, but I will double, triple, quadruple check next time I order from the manufacturer and spend this much money on a notebook. Um, that's the most I've ever spent on a notebook. So, um, I do like buy, sell, and trade um, because you can get a discount when you buy uh, like this one. If I sell this to you, I would not expect you to pay what I paid for it. Um, has embossing. I have it's it's basically used now, even though it's I have done nothing except put the notes in. Um, I've done a lot of touching, <laughs> but um, you would get a discount, you know, if if you bought it secondhand. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this. You can leave me comments below. Give me suggestions below if you'd like. Um, I am gonna like I said, I'm gonna go through all of my collection. I know that if these videos get too long, they cut you off. So I'll probably be tackling one type of uh, leather at a time when I'm going through, say, my Foxy Fix. I'll go through Wonderlust, and then I'll go through Olena, and then Everly, and Avalanche. Um, but I, if you have any questions, like I said, just leave a comment below. I'll be happy to get back in touch with you. Um, I hope you've enjoyed, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.